it's me, Ainora, and I know the camera is far away from me, but I just decided to try out a new background, so I hope you will like it. Anyways, this video is not about the background. As you can see by the title, it's all about Instagram and like how to get more followers, likes, and stuff like that, because I realized that a lot of people are concerned about their number of followers, likes, so today I'll give you some of my tips, so I hope you will find it helpful. not entering the giveaway it's still fine you can just comment down below your Instagram username so I can go and follow like comment and stuff like that so if you're something like this oh, I just uploaded this picture and no one liked it maybe like this I post so many awesome pictures and I have so less followers hmm what should I do? Then you probably have to watch this video. I have all the tips written on my phone, and if I look down, I hope you don't mind. Without making a long introduction, let's just hop into the video. So probably my first and most important tip is to post the right pictures that you think people will enjoy looking at, if that makes any sense. And don't forget, you can also add different filters. And wait, let me just tell you some of my favorite editing apps. At the moment, I'm really obsessed with the app called VSCO Cam, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Maybe it's Vasco Cam? I'm not sure. Another really cool app is Pixart and what you can do there is like also add different filters, also adjust the colors, brightness and darkness. The last editing app I would recommend is Afterlight, but it costs like one dollar I think, so it's really up to you if you want to just get Pixart and VSCO for free or Afterlight for one dollar. And no, 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 this video is not sponsored by them. I'm just telling you my honest opinion of what apps I really like. If you want to get your pictures noticed by others and like like maybe they will follow and like you and stuff like that then I would recommend using hashtags so for example if you're taking a picture of yourself then put a hashtag and then selfie or if you're taking a picture of your outfit of the day then put hashtag OOTD so if you use different hashtags then there's a big possibility that other people will be able to see your pictures and if they like it they will probably follow you my next tip is to post pictures of unique things so for example things that other people have never seen before and that will definitely attract more followers to your account for example so recently on my Instagram account I started posting more pictures of New York of the streets here and like the whole city life and that seems to attract more people so I would recommend you to go out and like take pictures of nature of the city where you live I think that would be really cool another thing I realized is that a lot of us are trying to post pictures following a certain theme to make your Instagram like on point <laughs> for example I know a few accounts that are posting pictures like only black and white themed and then others who are posting pictures mostly like fashion themed so choose your favorite category and follow it. My favorite feeds are That's So Jax and also Alicia Marie's and then Makeup by Mandy's and who else? I'll link them all down below. Or if you don't want to follow any theme, that's totally fine. It's up to you, so don't worry. My next tip is very, very important, at least for me. So it's that you have to post pictures at the right time, so not too late and not too early. So you could post the most amazing picture in the world, but sadly, not that many people will be able to see it if you upload it, like, let's say, at midnight. Personally, I really like uploading my pictures in the middle of the day, in the middle of the week. So that's probably when more people are online, searching the web, being bored at school. Or maybe in the evening, a little bit after dinner time so more people will be tired on their phone browsing through Instagram and stuff like that I know there are many time zones so yeah if you don't like this tip don't listen to it another great idea is to post pictures on special occasions so for example Halloween or Christmas or New Year's Eve and my last but not least tip is to be active and by that I mean follow other people comment on their pictures uh, follow your friends like their pictures and they will probably do the same to you also don't post too much or too less because sometimes people get bored so they might just unfollow you so these were some of my tips and tricks of how to get more followers and likes and stuff like that on Instagram and in no way I'm saying that I'm successful or anything it's just that this video was quite requested so I hope you enjoyed it wait there is a surprise for you one two three and this video also includes a mini giveaway so if you'd like to see the prizes and how to enter then keep watching so the prize is not that big but I'm still hoping you will like it so the first thing is this book called girl online and it's written by Zoella I actually read this book a few times already and I really enjoyed the story it's so entertaining and so addicting so I'm sure you will love it too and don't worry this book is the brand new one so yeah the next prize is the selfie stick and I think everyone has to have it this one is four feet long and you can take like group selfies and make videos 
videos, so that's really cool. This giveaway is international, so you can live anywhere in the world and still participate. This will end in around one month, so you have a long time to enter. All you need to do is follow me on Instagram, which is inora1999, and then repost your favorite picture from my account on yours, and tag me in the caption. And then comment down below if you entered, and also include your Instagram username. And if you can't enter because you don't have an Instagram account, then don't worry, I'll be having more and more giveaways in the future. And I'll see you very soon. Bye!